I had turned this way, the playful way, thoughts running astray, just a boy, when I kissed you, you blew my mind away, and I can't run So just from having a chat with uh, Sinori Exo right here on uh, the Weekend Grill, a quick one, we're having the legendaries, legends in the building, Tai 2, uh, right as well, his uh, current brand new song, amazing song, something very different I should make mention. Uh, something that are uh, speechless. That's something that we are talking about this afternoon on our weekend grill today on JFM. Good afternoon. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you? Mm, not bad. How have you been? Perfect. Okay. Been kept safe, and uh, yeah, I'm fine. Mm, yeah. <laughs> so I've seen you. No need of asking you how you are making some money because I've seen how much you've been pushing on people subscribing to YouTube. And also those uh, stream on Vesesani, mm. downloads, other stuff. How is it working? Are people adapting to the new type of uh, era of uh, buying music online? I mean, you know, when um, I'll, I'll link it to when we just started releasing our music, the days of the Smile album, you know, technology was a bit slow on our end. You know, Facebook, Instagram and them were not really um, in play. Mm -hmm. So as time goes, people adapt and they adjust and they go with whatever's new. So mm -hmm. it's all good, mm -hmm. catching up. Mm -hmm. yeah. but, but, but are your fans adapting to it? Yeah. Okay. I mean, look at the situation now. We, I have a fan base since way back, right? Obviously, when I just started, it was like young people like I was then. Still young anyways. Mm -hmm. But, you know, as time goes, they also evolve into whatever it is that's happening now. And introducing myself to the new audience who have mm -hmm. no idea who Tai 2 is mm -hmm. and to them I'm maybe um, an upcoming artist or something obviously some of them will, will see me like that because mm -hmm. they're used to a different type of music and it's beautiful for a person like me who went quiet came back um, went quiet again came back so it's more like I'm introducing myself to, to an audience that's uh, you know it, it takes some time for them to adjust to my type of vibe but mm -hmm. They still get to catch on. All right. Yeah. The new song, uh, Speechless, yeah. which is not uh, for free download. You decide to get to sell the music. Uh, put it on sale. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I don't know. Um, have you ever had uh, someone complain and just say, uh, we're not okay with uh, buying music or maybe everybody's in support and uh, this song is receiving massive uh, uh, massive response as well on uh, the design as well? Um, there are people that will always ask for a free link mm -hmm. and then, you know, you, you just make them understand. You say, look, um, let's, let's look at the COVID situation even, mm -hmm. not just COVID even, even from way back, mm -hmm. we've always complained about people, uh, you know, pirating the music and you find that the artists don't even enjoy whatever energy they put in. You don't even get back what you put in when recording because the studio has to be paid, the producer has to be paid, whatever you had to do, there was money involved. So how do you recover your your costs? Mm -hmm. So even if somebody complains, they just gotta understand this. Yeah. Business at the end of the day. Besides mm -hmm. having that passion for it, there's a part where you you gotta be vibrate at the end of the day. Mm -hmm. So yeah. is uh, Tai Two featuring Tai Two still available on uh, uh, um, all these other platforms? Yeah, I think I think it's still it's still on Versus Sunny. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's still on Versus Sunny. Okay, so all the albums are still on there. Okay, so someone can get to access them from they there. They can still access them. From All right. Let's talk about uh, something that has also been uh, trending for the past uh, few days. You have been mm -hmm. in the game for a long time. Yeah. Uh, new artists have been complaining a lot. I don't know if you have checked it out. Uh, saying uh, big artists are not helping us enough. Uh, we are looking for help or maybe we're looking for someone to support us. Yeah. In your time, when you were coming up, 
was there such a thing someone just uplifting you and just trying to help you to move a step ahead but with, with everything that you get to do um the initial capital starts with you how much effort are you putting in i've had messages where people have asked me can we do a song together can we do abcd i'm like okay so let me listen to your vibe if it's good i'll definitely work because if, if it's not then we're gonna have to sit down and plan how the whole thing can be executed <clears throat> But then some people would say, I need sponsorship. I need you to help me out, pay for this or whatever. I'm like, look, uh, truth of the matter is, at the moment in the way things are going, I don't think uh, people will actually come through and say, here's 10,000 questions to put in your, in your album because <laughs> you need to push. It's like you start up your business. You come to me. You need to sell. Tell me what you've done. How much effort have you gone into your product? <laughs> when you want to marry, what will the elders tell you? How much do you have? This is going to cost you ABCD. How much have you come up with? Same concept. With everything that you got to do. Even praying. Mm -hmm. you're, you're praying to God, asking for, for money. What are you doing to actually invest that really into that relationship with him? Mm -hmm. Same thing everywhere. Mm -hmm. So if you as a young artist would just come up to say, help me out. My question is, what have you put in? Yes, you've done the record. Okay, I'll tell you. Uh, you need to... Have you approached any radio stations? Have you put this somewhere? Have you done ABCD? Some people would just say, oh, just send a voice note. I say, oh, no, that's, that's me. Okay, that's it. What else have you done? Mm -hmm. It doesn't give me that vibe to really get into your product. It doesn't. I remember when I got into the studio, I went all the way from Rhodes Park to Charleston, where Sling Beats used to be. Mm -hmm. Got there, I had a conversation with Charles. Okay, I'm ABCD. I, I do music. I, whatever. He played the beat. So, okay, let me hear you. In front of people. And now I'm thinking, really? When we're going to have a closed door meeting or something. Yeah, yeah. Just there, it's like, okay, let's go. Mm -hmm. I had to sing whatever I had. But I made that effort to get to the studio. Go where the artists are found. Not just online. Because online, you don't even know who's responding to you. I can say, on my end, I respond. I'm actually the person that responds to people that send me messages on, on, mm -hmm. my, on my social platforms and all of it. I respond. But some people, you don't even know who you're talking to. Mm -hmm. So make that effort yourself. Mm -hmm. Complaining, we'll always complain. By the end of the day, nobody listens if you don't do something about it yourself. Mm -hmm. It's about putting in work. You put in. Let's complain. You put in. I will sit today and I want to get to a certain level. If I'm not putting in, how am I going to get to that level? Even if there's the tattoo name that's been around for, for mm -hmm. whatever time, mm -hmm. I still got to work. Mm -hmm. My new product now, I mean, I still got to work. I got to put in effort to mm -hmm. really show what it is that I'm doing and where I'm at. When it comes to the music, so mm -hmm. effort plays uh, a major role. All right, let's talk about your current song. What story are we talking about in Speechless, and also what motivated you to do the song? Speechless is a song where I'm speaking to God mm -hmm. to say I don't have the right words. I don't have anything that I'm cooking up in my mind to really communicate. But my prayer is He communicates and He sees my heart. I hope my heart transfers that message of everything I want to say. So it's the message that's pure and clean, you know, like I can say whatever and think about things, but then the heart always has a true intention of whatever communication is being created. Mm -hmm. So I'm asking God to see my heart and I'm hoping he just sees how much I adore him, how much I, I need him in my life. Mm -hmm. That's what speechless is about. Okay. Interesting. Something different. It's deep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I checked out the video for the song. <laughs> Amazing video. Who produced the song? Um, when you watch the video, the guy's playing the, the keyboard, Fred, yeah, yeah. he's the one that produced uh, Speechless. Okay. He actually produced Mutima as well. Yeah. Others, I don't know if you saw and listened to Mutima. Yeah, yeah. He's the one that's behind it as well. Okay. And he's producing my gospel album. Interesting. Yeah. So there's a gospel album coming. There's a gospel album. Title? Titled, I Am Home. I'm Home. I started with church. Okay. And I'm back in church. I, I, are you okay being put in that box? Okay. So Which one? Two, He's now a gospel artist. Yes, Taito is a gospel artist. No more doing secular music. Define circular. <laughs> <laughs> I know someone is gonna be <laughs> okay. Interesting. Uh, so uh, it's, it's it's amazing. So when do we expect the album? Um. Uh. Okay. Before the end of this year, it should be done. Okay. We uh we just spoke about eight songs on it, but you never know. Mm -hmm. I'll do I'll do it as the spirit leads. Mm -hmm. 
um, humming things every day and there's so much so we'll see could be 8 could be 12 could be 15 20 mm -hmm. but before the end of this year it should be out mm -hmm. a quick story uh, it a, has a, to be out a quick question though uh what made all the change what, what made everything like what made you to say okay let me just do something for the lord or maybe 